McCartney said in an interview, Everyone was messing with everyone. We were all playing around like we had nothing to do for a month. We didn't even have anything written down. I thought I had been too overbearing, that that had been the problem. But watching that movie, I saw that I wasn't being overbearing at all. I was just trying to get people to work. I was just like, come on guys, there's only two more weeks. People told me, even Peter told me, someone had to do it. Someone had to be that person. So I forgive myself. No freaked out yellow belly on the Gary Cooper gonna tend to the bound gonna make a dumb with Kevin to do. Sick and tired of rearing lines by seasick, narrow minded, short sighted hypocrite. All I want is the truth. We should change the guys, tell me some truth. I've had enough of reading lines by soon sit down, hard sided politicians. All I want is the truth. Just give me some truth. That period was kind of magical for me, he said in an interview with Dana Carvey and David Spade. In my memory, it always seemed to be darker because the Beatles were breaking up. The first film, Let It Be, was kind of set up having that in mind. I found it so depressing that I never wanted to watch it again. So when Peter Jackson was cast in this version, I said to him, I don't know if I'm gonna like this. Because, you know, I was guilty of End of the Beatles. Whereas in reality, it wasn't me. For years and years, I tried to explain it to people. 